Welcome to Kioware University, where we cover the ins and outs of using Kioware to its fullest potential. Today, we'll be discussing how to configure Kioware's latest product, KioTouch, a touchless kiosk interface solution designed to reduce pathogen spread on shared devices through an end user's personal device. In order to properly configure KioTouch within your Kioware kiosk system software, please take the following steps. Step 1. From the Assistive Technologies tab of the Kioware Config tool, enable KioTouch. Step 2. Enter the company ID and authentication key. These are given at the time of purchase and should be in your confirmation email. Step 3. With KioTouch enabled, we need to configure a QR code for the user to scan. This can be done by using our API to add it somewhere within your web application, creating a control on the toolbar or on an attract screen. If using our API, you can find everything you need on our website at m.kioware.com forward slash API under the KioTouch namespace. If using our toolbar control, simply navigate to the User Interface tab of the Kioware Config tool, edit your toolbar, and add the KioTouch Access Control. You can also edit the KioTouch Access Control to customize how it looks and functions. From the Toolbar Editor, you can control where you'd like the toolbar to show up as well. For the purpose of KioTouch, you can have the toolbar show up only during an active session, only during a tracked mode, or always. We have found many machines require a toolbar height of at least 100 pixels for the KioTouch QR code to scan properly from the toolbar. This may be different for you depending upon your monitor size and computer settings. Well, there you have it. Three easy steps and plenty of options to configure KioTouch for your needs. That's it. Scan your QR code with your phone or tablet to take remote control of the kiosk. Thank you for watching Kioware University. Remember to check out other lessons for more features that allow you to take full advantage of Kioware.